Hi, my name is Chad Bettis, and I'm the author of The Disciple Making Parent and uh, other resources aimed at the family. And I appreciate the, the request to share my favorite proverb with you. The only problem is that uh, I have so many different favorites that I ended up procrastinating uh, the request. But I've decided uh, to share with you Proverbs 20, verse 5. And Proverbs 20, verse 5 says, The purposes of a man's heart are deep waters, but a man of understanding draws them out. The purposes of, of a person's heart are, are deep. They're deep waters. But a man, a person of understanding, will draw those out. That's a good verse for me as a, as a parent, as a pastor, as a grandparent. It reminds us that, that what we see on the surface is, is not always true of what's going on in the heart. And not only uh, that, but that we can actually bring those things out through good questions. You know, God is the one who tells us that man looks on the outward appearance, but it's God who looks on the heart. And we need to imitate him in, in drawing out what's going on deep inside. Social scientists uh, tell us that as humans, we communicate uh, cliche level, and then we uh, communicate information, how was your day? And then we, down deeper though, with the fewer people we share is our uh, uh, is our opinions and our feelings and transparency. That's, that's what we're getting down to when we, we talk about the heart. But the good news from that verse is that a man of understanding, a person of understanding, a parent, a grandparent, a pastor can draw out, uh, can draw those purposes out. How? It's often through good questions. Good questions uh, allows a person to actually reflect on and for us to hear what's going on in the, in the heart. And, and kind of sandwiched with this verse is also uh, another proverb that, that sort of that goes along with it, which is Proverbs 18, 13, that says, He who speaks before listening, it's to his folly and shame. Uh, so don't, don't speak before I listen. How many times have I applied that to myself? And of course, the great news is that we know the Lord Jesus uh, listens to us. He, is, he, he listens to his children, and we uh, love him for that and appreciate that uh, in him. So as I grow uh, to be a better pastor, parent, uh, grandparent, I want to grow in questions. I want to grow in drawing out those deep purposes that are in a person's heart.